Hello guys and welcome to the 1963 TARDIS rewrite which is behind me but before we do look behind me we shall look into the void of space because this is actually a uh, international space station map which I chose because it's firstly got a great view and also very relevant because if you live in the United Kingdom and especially the north of it you will be able to see for at least two weeks the International Space Station pass over by in fact there may be a video I put on now of me seeing this for four minutes I saw the International Space Station which I was incredibly excited to see because I looked through binoculars and you can see the sort of wafer that is the solar panels and it's really incredible to see like just, just imagine there's people up in space and um, yeah I was just really excited to see it and um, obviously Stargazing Live's back if you're on UK and watch BBC which is quite an interesting program but I'm guessing you came here for the video and the thumbnail because that's just like what I do. Um, the TARDIS 1963 First Doctor version and <sighs> wow. Um, this is not actually made by the Drunk Turtle, we made the um, the Capaldi TARDIS. This is made by a separate person um, who helped me with some other stuff but um, I say but too much. <coughs> We're gonna go ahead and close the doors, save some frames, probably not, and, oh, no, hold on, open the doors, to show you that, because look, they actually, <laughs> just like, they just happen exactly like in the program, I really love that little detail, I also like this sort of gold, um, gold coat hanger thing, and there's a chair as well. Um, right, let's go onto the console, because there's quite a lot to explore, in fact, in the Doctor's, um, which is his team name, I'm not sure what his real name is, um, these version of the TARDIS is, he actually puts some rooms in, so we're going to definitely try and check them all out, in fact I'm going to try and upload all TARDIS's videos today because I'm so excited and everything. Right, so let's look at the console, this actually surprised me because I didn't believe that it was going to be animated, but some parts are animated, like that. is going on. Look how much is animated. You did see, oh my god, even the switches make sound effects. I love that. And also it's everything's flashing. Center column isn't animated yet, but it certainly looks cool. And um, I can't wait to see that bad. I mean, seriously, these controls look very, very good. I mean, also, sorry about the gravity. <laughs> I'm on a space map. Space tends to have very little gravity. Yes, let's have a look. I mean, ooh. Well, that made the as well. I like the switches. And you've got all of these ones as well. So yeah, it's quite a functional console. You can definitely run around and um, be a Dalek in the TARDIS, <laughs> pretending to be a Doctor. So let's have a look at the other rooms. Um, I don't mind... Um, oh, do these doors shut? Then I don't mind having like not extensive rooms because even like just... I don't know, making a map running into the TARDIS and escaping into little, like, hidey holes pretty good as well. Um, but yeah, I quite like this room. It's very sort of Star Trek-y. Slash Doc 2. Not sure what this does. It says water, so I'm guessing I should probably leave that. Also, I have the, um, um, the uh, sonic screwdriver. And then we can have a look at the round things, because everyone loves the round things. Oh yes, the round things are oh, beautiful. Um, then we can walk into this, what looks like a server room, um, which I remember from actually the, about the, the Christmas one of the episodes, because this TARDIS came back, I think, and um, yeah, these don't have any lights though, so um, yeah, there's the seat and everything, you can walk back around as well. So it's got a small TARDIS considering, but uh, the con- uh, the co- uh, ew, yeah, I think the words out. The console is where all the magic is happening today. I mean, look at look even these switches animate, and I really like that. I mean, everything, everything's animating. In fact, should we try flying it? I mean, even this has a brand new model as well, which I was surprised about. Oh, I do like this a lot. Doesn't that look good? 
and the International Space Station behind me. That's pretty cool. I really do like this episode. Um, <laughs> this episode, yes. <laughs> I really do like this TARDIS. I don't know what those are. Yeah. It's a very white sort of map, isn't it? In fact, oh, whoa, 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 what? Um, we are spinning out of control now. I like you can sort of <laughs> hide behind these. Yeah. But we seem to be orbiting the Earth now. That's worrying. It's like driving train simulator, isn't it? Well, I'm sorted because that's one of the only games I can actually play. And look, as we can see into it as well. Uh, that's pretty cool. I really do like this one. So yeah, pretty short video, I guess. Um, link in the description, of course, because, well, <laughs> no. Because I definitely think you all want to see this, and there's also a TV monitor here. So, um, yes. Go enjoy the 1963 TARDIS. I'm certainly am doing.